with the number five pick in the NBA draft. The Utah Jazz select Dante Exum. Unknown talent from down under. What we do know is he's talented. What we also know is he's big. Six foot six. This guy's a unique talent at that guard spot, can run the point. His offensive game is pretty polished. He's good, good enough, long and wiry enough to get inside and finish amongst the trees. The biggest question mark, can he put on more muscle? Also, hasn't really seen a lot of consistent competition. So how will he fare against the pros? However, I'm really shocked. Yes, the Jazz got a talented kid, but I'm shocked they didn't go big. They need somebody down low along with favors to give you more of a scoring punch. I like out of Indiana, Noah Vonley. I'm really surprised that they didn't go this route. This kid gives you a lot. Versatility, can step out on the pick and pop, can pop and knock down that shot, can finish down low. People have been loving this kid. I'm surprised that he slides down the board. So yes, Utah got talent. Talented enough to be a starter. I can't say he's going to be a Hall of Famer or he's going to be an All-Star simply because I haven't seen him against that consistent competition. Regardless, stick with us here at Campus Insiders. I'm going to be breaking down every team, telling you who did it right and who did it wrong, baby. Inside the Draft is presented by Progressive.